anyway. Ooh, Jesus. We he ain't on our feet. He laying next to us in the oh, bed. Oh my goodness. He laying next to us in the bed, calling us oh, on the phone. My goodness. Coming by our jobs. Oh my goodness. I just just I'm, I just oh, messed it up, goodness. didn't I? I'm sorry, yeah. y'all, but I had yeah. to tell the truth. We we yeah. we play with the devil too much. And some of us mm. are married. Oh. Oh my goodness. Hello, did I just say that? Is this Oh my goodness. <laughs> I got to tell the truth. Watch this. We ne- we don't even consult God about who we need to talk to, oh. uh, hang out with. Watch oh. this. It, watch this. And that goes back to prayer. He'll tell us. He'll instruct us yes. in every facet of our life. But we think we know everything. Oh, my goodness. We don't need him, Jesus. We just need you for this little part over here that we can't take care of. Oh, my goodness. Lord, we just need you because we didn't really manage our money, right? So now we need a financial oh blessing. Uh, but one thing about him. Come on. When we have a relationship with him, mm-hmm. we develop a resume. Mm. We develop a resume that lets us know that God can handle it. <laughs> we develop a resume that he says can handle he it, can Kay. fix it. He can fix it. He can fix it. Come he on. can work it out. He can work it if out. If we trust him, if we obey him, if we love him, if we seek him, he'll make it happen for us. Why? Because we came to him with a sincere well, heart. Watch this. You said if so many times. Two yes. little letters, but it's a really big word. If. Oh, if. Now watch this. I'm going to go here. If, if my, my people. people. He's talking to us, the <sighs> believers, the saints, the Christians. The Christian. Christian. If my people. If my people. Which are called by my, my name. name. So that lets us know he was talking to, if you will, the church yes, or the body of Christ. Christ. If my people, which are called by my name, shall humble themselves. <sighs> take meant. down your selfish ways, your oh, selfish attitudes. Goodness. Come on now. Stop being Church stubborn. folks are so selfish. They don't want to help anybody more. And Rebellion. I know a lot of it is because we see things on TV yes. that has happened, and it makes you almost think, I don't want to, I'm too afraid. But Offended. watch this, Jesus didn't stop. No, he did So we can't stop. Just because somebody talked about you, lied on you, that don't mean you the scripture stop. says they did it to the green tree, they'll do it to the dry. So, therefore, we need some tough skin and keep on pushing forward because in prayer we have to be persistent. Mm. We have to be diligent because, remember, when we come into a relationship, we develop a resume. Uh, but watch this. Your resume is empty because you have an if my people to come on and show themselves and pray, seek my, my. Face. Oh my How do goodness. we seek? We seek in prayer. We seek when we turn everything off, turn the TV off. Uh, we're not on Facebook tonight. We're going to go talk to Christ. That sounds yes. too much like, right, we're not watching Power or any other oh show on goodness. TV. We're going to go talk to Jesus. And that means I'm turning the TV off and I'm getting on my knees. I'm sitting up right because there are different postures of prayer. Yes. And I'm really talking to the Lord. I'm being sincere. Yes. I'm telling him my heart. heart. I'm not yes. trying to use these big lofty words that, that we don't know half of them what they mean and you're trying to sound all eloquent in yes. speech and God is and, 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 and you missing the, the mark because you're not saying the right thing in prayer this thing is very serious it is very the crucial. enemy is wreaking havoc in your life because you're not saying the right thing Lord help me is good it's good enough it start. really is it's, it's a place. start but watch this we got to go beyond that we got to go beyond Lord bless me your ha, word. Ha, ha. we got to go beyond that we have to go and know how to rightly call all those things in our lives call all things out of the atmosphere yes. and shut the enemy down yes. shut the access points off to the devil yes. we're playing because we're our prayer about it and that's just an excuse me now I don't want to talk about it right now we'll deal with it later come on let's be for real because if we were really praying the rest of that scripture says seek my, my face. face he said early will I seek early. thee yeah, early in the morning God will wake you up at 3 o'clock in the oh, morning yes, you might will. think you run into the bathroom but he's really saying come, come talk to me come, yeah, my come talk to me yes Ah, Jesus, the, the king of kings is, is beckoning for you. He's giving you access to come into the room and talk to him. Yes, because he got some things he yeah. wants to share with us ah, before Jesus. we leave the door, come before on. we go out to face the world, yes, before yes, you yes, go yes. to the job, before you take the children to school. He said, come, 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 because you're going to deal with something mm. on the outside, but I want to prepare you on the inside. On, I so want to be prepared that. is what you're telling me. We're oh, not prepared. If we don't pray. If we don't pray. So the purpose of prayer, think about everything that we've said, is for you to understand the will of God yes. as it pertains to your life, yes. as it pertains to your next step, yes. your next move, what you should be thinking. Watch this. Everything is in his word, which is in prayer. Come on now. We got to learn how to pray his word. He can't fight his word. No. He won't resist his word. He looks to perform. Right. He looks to perform his that. word. He won't let one jot or one tittle 
pass without his word doing what it's supposed to do. What? So we have to get in there and say the right things in prayer. The enemy is getting us. And I said the last time the devil, the Bible says he goes to the Lord twice a day. Yes. About us. Mm. Accuse the other brother. Accuse of the brother and watch this. And if you're not putting anything in the prayer realm to, to combat what the devil is saying, this is why he has legal access to some of your lives. Yes. Because we don't understand the power that we possess in our mouths mm. if we speak the word of God. If we go have a relationship with Christ. He'll, he'll give you strategies yes. on how to fight the enemy. Yes. We don't have strategies because we ain't been in the presence. Oh, my goodness. We don't have strategies because we haven't been talking to them. Oh, my We're goodness. We too busy talking to our friends and oh. on Facebook and Twitter. Watch this. I ain't knocking them because I'm on them too. But watch this. I know when it's time to go talk to the master. Uh, when it's time to go talk to dad. When he's wooing me. Uh, when yes. he's calling me back yes. to the throne room. Uh, uh, when I feel that nudge. I, I just want to go be in his presence. Just lay out before him and just talk to him watch this and i'm not doing all the talking because you said something earlier that it was about communication yes. communication has a receiver and a transmitter yes hmm? mm -hmm. a receiver That's and a good. transmitter yes. and so we have to know when to shut up in prayer Ooh, be quiet be still mm. and know that i'm watch this we got to know how to be still in prayer yes everything is not always asking god and begging god and petitioning god sometimes he just want us to to be still in his presence yes. have you been there yes. yes when you get there certain certain things he can even cut off of us when come we're on. in his presence come on when we're seeking his face and say god what do i need to do about this because he said ask mm -hmm. and it shall be what given mm -hmm. seek and we shall find knock and doors would open mm -hmm. so therefore there is a time where we are just still in his presence because we're not asking for nothing because you know when you're in a relationship with somebody you don't even have to ask you just thought it and it started happening why because the person that you love said because you're doing this and you've done this i'm going to bless you with that mm -hmm. you may have said i wanted this last week to your spouse and then your spouse he didn't even tell you he was going to buy it just because out of love he did it for you and that's what happens when we're in the presence of god mm -hmm. when we're laying before him yeah, yeah. we were talking about about something that we would like to do for the kingdom of God and have and all of a sudden God shows up early mm -hmm. and manifested without us even asking come on because he wants to know that we're loving him yes. and not just the hand that he oh. has for the things that he has. He, he wants to make sure he doesn't have a problem with things, but he has a problem with things having us oh. ruling over us, being yes. idols. Yes. He has a problem with God Come is on. a jealous God. He, he will yes, not he have is. anything yes, people he place yes, he before is. him. That's why he says, seek ye first the, the kingdom, kingdom of God and his righteousness. righteousness. Why? So we can know order. We can know the expectations of the heart of God. We can know the do's and the don'ts. Come on, come when you on your job, they tell you the do's and the don'ts, mm -hmm. right? And so when we enter the kingdom of God, we have 66 books come on. that tell us the do's and the don'ts, uh, the consequences. Uh, what happens when come we on. do right? Huh? What happens when we don't do right? Huh? What happens when we wish we had it done right? Uh. And how it can turn <laughs> around <laughs> for us huh? if we just bow and before we the king. Seek his face <laughs> and turn. That means to do something different. Mm. That means if I continue to sin, the same sin, then I'm really not. I'm really not doing what Part I'm. Part of asking. that definition, if you keep doing the same thing the same way, expecting a different result, is the definition of insanity. insanity. Oh my ah. goodness! So that means that I'm not fully persuaded. That mm -mm. I am repenting about mm -mm. the issue mm -mm. of my past, mm -mm. the issue that the enemy keeps bringing up mm -mm. about things that you go through mm -mm. and you're not really letting go of a habit. You're not really letting go of something because you keep returning back to it. And somebody say, well, I just love what I'm doing. Well, just admit that to God. Mm -hmm. God, I love what I'm doing. Change my mind. Yeah. Yeah. If you just yeah. pray, Lord, me. change my mind. Yes. Change my heart. Change my thoughts. My attitude. Change my attitude. If I just be real. If I just be real. And be sincere with God. God's looking for sincerity. He can help us. 
if we just be honest before mm -hmm. the Lord. We keep talking about honesty mm -hmm. because God requires mm -hmm. that we will worship him in spirit, spirit and, and in, in truth. truth. Come on. So if we do that, then we can overcome. Yes. Because Jesus overcame, right? Right, right, right. So now we can overcome because he gives us the grace. Mm -hmm. His uh, grace is sufficient for, for thee. thee. Come on, you Because book. we acknowledge him and we talk to him. Mm -hmm. And we when we like something, we acknowledge it before mm -hmm. him. He can give us the grace to overcome the struggle and somebody need to know that that you can overcome the struggle if you just be honest so we got to be sincere when we come to him and tell yes. him the truth he already knows he already he already knows he already knows so watch this we're going to get into something and that is if he already knows then why do we need to pray wow that, that's a good question. That, is that was proposed question. to us last, last, was last week or the other day. Yes. If God already knows, then why do we need to pray? Prayer creates a relationship with Christ. Yes. And in creating that relationship, it creates trust yes. and faith. And it yes. builds us, builds our character in Christ. And it also strips of us of looking like ourselves and starting yes. to look more like him. Since we're created in his image and his likeness, a lot yes. of us are taking on the name, but we still look like us. Oh. There's been no change. Hello, somebody. But did he give us authority to do something? Yes, else? he did. And because we are his vessels, he mm -hmm. needs a vessel to operate through. Is that mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. So a that willing, that, that's, oh, that's the, a willing okay. vessel. A, willing a lot of times we, we claim we're vessels, but we're not yielded or willing. Ooh, that is so true. We're not yielded or willing. But we have keys. Mm. We but don't know how to use them. Oh, my goodness. Can you imagine somebody standing in the door with the key to this padlock? And on the other side of that door... Is all the blessings you can imagine. Oh, my goodness. Everything you've ever prayed for. Oh, my goodness. And you have the key in your hand. Yes. And you're standing at the door, but you don't know how to use the key. Oh, my goodness. That, that, that's a picture right there. Because Satan is the what? Prince of the air. And mm. he tries to blind us from seeing. But watch this. If we haven't been yielded and willing, if we haven't, don't have a prayer life, you're Ooh. still standing at that door and you can see every Everything. blessing that you've oh ever prayed for. Oh, my goodness. And it's in your reach. But you won't use the key to open the door. What? And that key is prayer. Yes. That's how important it is. That's how vital it is. Paul said one instance is more than my necessary food. I, wait a minute. I felt that thing. Ooh. It's more than my necessary food. Although he was talking about his chair. It's more yes. than his necessary food. That's how important prayer is. You want your life change? Pray. Pray. You want Much your marriage prayer. change? Come on. Pray. Come on. You want your family change? Pray. pray. Huh? And not, Lord, touch me, touch my daddy, touch my... Watch this. That's okay if you don't know nothing else to say. But you got to start reading and researching. Lord, what do you... What does this mean? There's a prayer language that will grab the very ear and heart and attention of Christ. Yes. Huh? I, 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 somebody, I forgot who this was preaching one time. He said, when, when, when the children of God begin to pray... Ooh. God is on the throne. And then he says, when he starts praying, he starts leaning. Wait a minute, my kid's calling me. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> is that what happened to Paul and Silas? Ah, he, they start calling on him. At midnight. Yes. yes. Jeez, they start calling on him. Who's having a midnight <laughs> in their life Woo. right now? If you are having a midnight, I dare you to pray. Yes. I dare you to get in a call place. on him. I dare you to begin to call on him. I don't know what to say. Just say, Jesus, I need you. Yes. It, Jesus, I need you. Yes. Lord, I need your help right now. Right now. Lord, I need your strength right now. And I promise you, God will come in and you'll look up. He done changed the situation. Or oh, he didn't change you for the situation. Oh, you said wow. something right there. Wow. Changed the situation or prepared us to walk through it. The situation. The situation. And we have a lot of situations going on. A lot of issues are going on. People are dealing with things in their lives. And you need to understand that prayer is a part of your arsenal. Yes. Your heavenly arsenal and it's very vital and powerful. Listen, when we talked about the armor that we're supposed to put on. Yes. Have our feet shot with the preparation of gospel. I shield of faith and I sword of the spirit. And he says, take prayer. Watch this. That in that scripture alone, he mentions prayer five times. Five Ooh. times. This is how important prayer is. Then if prayer is so important then we still need to repent. We're missing the mark. We're missing the whole reason. What is that? Are we praying amiss? Oh. Which means you're missing it. You're Are missing the mark. Are we doing it to be seen? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yes, she did. 
Yes, she did. And she meant it. Watch this. And she meant it because a lot of us, we can pray and holler and scream, but it's God hearing your prayers. Is it going is past it, watch, the ceiling? Is, is it going past the ceiling? That's a good question. Is it really going past the ceiling? Are you praying because you're in love with God? Are you crying out to him? Or, or are you wailing for him? Are you wailing so somebody can see you? Are they really deep in yeah. prayer? Then the Bible says you've got your reward. Well, already. Already. So don't expect nothing in heaven because you've already gotten your reward because you want man to see you. I'd rather God see Ooh. me. Come on now. I'd rather God see me. I'd rather God see me because watch what we'll be praying. Secret God will reward us yes, openly. openly. Yes. Am I in the book? He'll yes. reward us openly. Just start praying and praying honestly, not because you want a whole lot of stuff. Yeah. Don't you know you'll get your biggest blessings when you don't ask for nothing for you? Ooh. When you go on and, and, and get in the prayer on behalf of somebody else, intercession. when you're interceding, mm. huh, we, don't, we don't think about stuff like that. Mm. And we need to mm -hmm. because it's vital to our walk with the Lord. Mm -hmm. See, we're not just talking about a one-day moment. Mm. We're talking about an everyday moment. And that's where our faith increases come on, come on. in God. That's why we live and move and have our very existence because of God, we want his will to be established. Therefore, get a devotion. Mm. You take a little story, and then at the end of the story, there is a prayer because mm. prayer changes our Come situation. On, changes things, These are not just words that we're just releasing in the air, but when we decree the word of God, it changes yes, our circumstances. Yes. It changes our health. Why? Because we have called on the one who can do something. Mm. It's all right to call your prayer partner sometime and touch and agree, but there are certain times where you just need to cry out to God and God will hear and answer. Yes, he will. He hears and answers. Yes, he will. And we need to know the word because God wants us to know his word yes. so the word can change us. The word is to come to what? Mm. Renew our mind. Change the way we respond to life so we can look like Christ. The Bible said put thee on the Lord Jesus Christ. So when we begin to go forth in prayer yes. and you begin to grow in the Lord and you begin to decree his word back to him, he looks to perform to his perform word. It, to he perform. wants to do it he for us. To. But we put his word before mm -hmm. him that's what he wants yes. it's not that he doesn't know his word he wants to know do we know ah he said a word have i hid in, in my, my heart, heart that, that i might not sin, sin against, against thee so watch this it's not like some word is not hidden in some folks oh heart. my goodness help us lord because if we really knew his word oh my goodness and watch this not just with head knowledge oh but because that knowledge he was talking about no is heart oh, knowledge, knowledge. Hmm? When it gets in your heart, you won't sin against it. Oh. Watch this. And if you mess up, you are quick to repent and not do that thing again. We don't repent uh, just for the case of repenting. We repent not to do those things again. We, we have to turn. 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 That means when you turn, you change of direction. You change, you change directions. Watch as you're no longer in the same vein. I, I, I got to get out of this place. Yes. Huh? Seek my face and turn from their the wicked, wicked ways. Way. So. Watch this. Then he's wicked. Yeah, wicked. Oh, wicked and perverse generation. Come on now. Wicked. Oh, she said wicked. Wicked. Watch this. So we're supposed to turn. And in prayer, God will begin to turn your heart. So yeah. why is our ways wicked? <laughs> because our thoughts are wicked. Our hearts are wicked. Oh. Huh? But we belong to him. We belong to him. We, but mm, that, that, then sometimes I think that is even a question. Because if you see me and I'm smoking and I'm drinking and I'm doing all this stuff. Of my old man. And, and I keep seeing the old person show up. When is the new person going to show up? Because the moment you accepted Christ, you became a new creature. Sure. Old things have uh, passed pass away. All things have become new. Not saying that, you know, because sometimes we still struggle with certain things because we yeah. won't let it go. Oh, ooh, we won't ooh, let because it go. Because Christ will make you an ex-anything. Come on, ex. It makes you an ex-drinker, ex-smoker, yes. ex-strip pole dancer, yes. whatever you was doing. Who yes. am I talking to? Watch this. He'll make you an ex. Yes. Which means you no longer do it. You've walked away from that Because you didn't want it. And watch this. He's not going to take something like that from you and not replace it with something. Because if you leave that void empty, the enemy's quick to come back and try to take up Ooh. residence again. So he's going to fill it with something that you can now maybe worship like you've never before oh. and get into the presence of God like never before. Now I want to shift and let's talk about these different positions or postures of prayer. Hmm? Yes. And they're, 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 they're powerful. They're powerful because what we don't realize is sometimes the way we sit, mm. 
how we're sitting, how we're looking up, when we lift our hands. Uh, uh, there are different forms of praise and adoration. Yes. But we sometimes only, you know, we think about getting prayer and we got to get on our knees, honey. If your knees hurt, sit and pray. pray. We just want you to pray. And effectively your, now yes. that that's the key part because we can sit there and say lord touch me touch my mama touch my daddy touch my cousin and them mm -hmm. but how is effective is it father in the name mm -hmm. of jesus lord i need you to touch watch this you ain't got to get no preaching sound or nothing mm -hmm. lord i need you to touch me and my family right now we're going through and we need your help i can do it sitting yes i can do it standing I can do it with my hands lifted. Yes. But this one really gets me. I can do it prostrate. Oh, yes. Prostrate. That's yeah. what I love about God. When we can lay before Yee, him Jesus, on yes. the threshing floor. Yes, 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 uh, yes, 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 uh -huh, yes. Get your cover and get your pillow and get you some music and let the Holy Ghost go to work on the inside. Because, see, there are some things that you don't even have to say, but if you just lay before him. Because it goes all over the scripture says that well, he'll make moanings and groanings that cannot Ooh. be understood. He know what we need to say when yes. we don't know what we need to say. That's right. And let him take your tongue, not somebody teach you how to, oh, my to say goodness. some tongues. Well, and okay. He coming on a we'll Honda. Okay. okay, we won't go there. But nevertheless, yes. when you're in prayer and you're laying prostrate, prostrate just means you're laying on your face. Yes. Yeah, I'm literally laying on the floor yes. on my face yes. Before talking to God Yes. in his presence at the foot of the throne. Yes. yes. Jesus, Lord, if you can just let me touch your feet, I'll be all right. Oh. Yeah. Watch this. But I'm in your presence. Yes. And I'm just there. Sometimes I can't say anything. I lose all track of time. Yes. Come on now. And I'm just there. I'm not begging you for anything. Lord, I'm not even going to ask you for anything. I just want to be in your presence. And I promise you, when you get there, oh, he'll begin yes. to download and upload oh, in your yes, spirit. He will. He'll begin to shift some things in your life because you're in his presence. presence. Ooh, well, that means you got to tap in. You done Ooh, turn off happy. everything. There's nothing, nobody calling you on the phone. You're not looking at your phone. You're not worried about who on Facebook. You're oh, not worried about anything. You're just worried about his presence. Because in his presence is the fullness of joy. Mm -hmm. Everything we need, we can get in his presence. And the enemy, when you're laying on the threshing floor, you can't even hear him. Why? Because you're in his presence. Presence. Yeah, yeah, there's a place where the enemy can't even mess with you. No, yeah, it is. Because you're in his presence. presence. Ah, Jesus, when the, ah, the angels are circling and covering Ooh. you and watching you because you're in, in his presence. presence. Somebody need to tap in mm. to the presence. Come on, come on. Somebody is saying, how do I get there? Get you a worship yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah. tap into the presence. Come on. I, while you're laying on the threshing floor, come on. saying, Lord, it's me, oh Lord. Uh, standing I stand in the, the need, need of prayer. prayer. Come on. I need you, not my mother, not my father. Ah, uh, but it's me, me, oh Lord. Okay. <laughs> standing in the need of prayer. I need you now. Yes. I, I, I don't want nothing from uh. you, but I, I need you in my life more. I need you to cut away some things. I, I need you to change some things on the inside of me so I can walk up right yes. before you, so I can fulfill the will. Uh -huh. yeah, what yeah, you're yeah, calling yeah. your people to do when you get down there, it gets real personal. Mm. I, because you want the will of God to be done. And you're saying, well, I've done this and I've done that. He can take it like a sweet potato fine, stir it all up and make it what? Work together mm. for the good. Because guess what them same things you were delivered from them same things on, that he on. caused you to walk away from and caused you to walk in victory is sometimes he'll send you back to those right one back, in bondage right and pray them because through. he delivered you that's why I said you can be the greatest witness Come that on. they ever did see those people like that are bible stories eh, it'll be all right but when they can see you where they there and they know where you used came to be from. where you came from it'll shift their thinking well maybe there's something to this God thing. Me. Maybe there's some hope for me. Maybe there's some promise for me. Lord, yes. do it in me yes. that I can be a witness yes. to somebody else. Lord, do it for us, but you're going to have to get in prayer. Yes. Is that what happened when Jesus met the Samaritan woman? She was in his presence. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And the, he asked her questions yeah, yeah. to bring her closer. Yeah, yeah, you notice yeah. how he asked her questions <laughs> to Come bring on. her closer to yeah, him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he already knew what he was going to do in her yes. life, but she didn't know who she was standing in. The talking to. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Is that what happens sometimes when we're in the presence of God that we don't even know we're in and have tapped into a place in him, mm -hmm. but he wants to draw us closer to him because he wants to fill us 
in the places where we thought the well, we people, heard. places, yes. and things needed to be. And God said, I got some living water for you. Mm. I got some water that'll satisfy. you never your thirst again. Woo! Never, never, and after never being thirst again. Filled, she took off. <laughs> Let me tell you about a man that told me everything and didn't judge me. Come on. But wanted to love me. Gave me an opportunity. Told me all that I had done. This man knew everything. Everything. My daughter gave me some living water. Woo. That changed my soul. Mm, 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 mm. Not from wanting. Her thing was men. But what is your thing? Oh, that was good. What is the thing? What is your thing? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What is your thing? That keeps you crippled. Oh. Keeps you up at night. Keeps you immature. Keeps you at a baby state. Keeps you studded growth. Ooh. Come on now. What is your thing? What is your thing? That was good. That was good. That was good. What, what is, is your, your thing? thing? Oh, my God. Oh, I could tell you a whole lot of things that I had. Yeah. But thanks be unto God. What is your thing? What is your thing that you think, well, if I told that, they wouldn't. Uh, they wouldn't love me no more. They would judge me. Come on me. now. Come on. But they she, would judge me. Jesus won't on. judge you. Jesus won't judge you at all. Come on. Come on. Come on. He, he, said, he just waiting on, on you to, to give me. it to him. Yeah, 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 yeah. He asked her a question. He can bear it, too. Come yes, on he now. can. Yes, he can. He said, how many? Where's your husband? <laughs> <laughs> like he didn't know. No. Come on now. He wanted her to know. No. I know what you're doing. Yeah. I know what you're doing. I know doing. where you're at. I know, what, I know how low you didn't went to do it. You want, what street you want. Uh-huh. You know what uh-huh. it is. What's Come your on. thing? What's your thing? What's your thing? And, and when he revealed to her. Is your thing secret. drugs? Come on now. Come on now. Because he revealed to her. Yes, her he did. Yes, he did. And, and she looked at him. Oh, you're a prophet, huh? You, <laughs> you just going to read me you like just, that, Yeah, Jesus? you going to tell me. You just going to call me. Bust me out like that, Jesus. Okay, the man I'm with ain't even mine. Okay. Okay. Well, what is it? What is your thing? What is it drugs? Is it alcohol is it women is it men is what it is men is thing? it women not these days you gotta ask oh, yes what, you do what is it god is bigger than any thing <laughs> that we could he's ever a healer face. of all things yes. come on he can work it out yes your things ah, just take your things to him in prayer yes and give it to him yeah, and I promise you, he'll fix your things. Yes. yes, he'll fix you in the midnight. He'll fix your family and bring you to a place. And bring you to a place, ah, a place that was is an expected end. Ah, Come it's on, a place. Come, Come on. on, a place of abundance. He'll work it out if you just give it to him in prayer. And you'll go run and tell somebody mm. about a man. Watch as there are prayers of thanksgiving, prayers, prayers. of supplications, yes. prayers of healing, prayers of, prayers of adoration, all types of prayer. We can't go into every type of prayer. But watch this. If you just start studying, yes. watch this. If you can Google, if you can get on Google and Google what somebody's wearing, the latest outfit, surely oh you can Google goodness. how many different types of prayers there are and start learning them. I am putting a a, 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 a a challenge. I dare you to start praying for one week and watch the Lord change your life. Who am I talking to? Because you've been curious about this thing. You've been curious about what God can do for you. Yes. You've been curious about how you, you know, you know you need your life changed, but you didn't know the steps. I'm asking you for one week to just pray. I don't care if it's two or three minutes. Just tell God, since Father God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we thank you now. Yes, we Lord. ask that and we send out a decree of prayer yes, all over God. this nation, all over this country. Yes, Let God. the spirit